Hi Curious, how are you? Leo here again. Today you will know the 25 curiosities of the First World War. But before you subscribe to the channel, comment on something here below, and if you like the video, please like it. Let's go. Number 1, did you know that at the beginning of the war, the USA did not want to participate in the conflict? So, in order to convince the population that it was necessary to fight on the side of France and Great Britain, British agents started to sell stories to American newspapers in which they instigated the population to feel anger against German immigrants who lived in the country, and had absolutely nothing to do with the war. Number 2, when Walt Disney was only 16 years old, he dropped out of high school and used false documents to enlist and participate in World War I as a member of the Red Cross Ambulance Corps in France. Number 3, during the conflict, a group of Russian and German soldiers agreed to declare a temporary ceasefire so that the soldiers could fight off a wolf attack. Number 4, there was a Portuguese soldier who, fighting alone, convinced a German platoon that the soldiers were fighting an entire unit of officers. His name was Enibol Augusto Milhais, and for this feat he was decorated with the Military Order of the Tower and Sword, of Valor, Loyalty and Merit of the Army of Portugal. Number 5, the US Army was the only one of the Allied forces that did not distribute condoms to its soldiers during World War I, and as a result more than 400,000 officers returned from the conflict with some type of sexually transmitted infection. Number 6, the different armies involved in the conflict used dogs as messengers. The soldiers used to put messages containing orders inside capsules which were attached to the dogs' bodies and taken to the front lines of the battles. Number 7. Did you know that Manfred von Richthofen, the legendary pilot known as the Red Baron, almost didn't take off in World War I? That's because he originally began his career as a lancer in the German cavalry, and after his unit was disbanded, he was transferred to a communications corps. Only later, in 1915, did Richthofen decide to enlist in the Imperial Air Service, where his performance made him a historical icon. Number 8, Look at this ironic thing. The US Army veteran who received the most decorations for his participation in World War I was not an American. He was a Mexican immigrant who did not have the documentation to legalize his stay in the US. His name was Marcelino Cerna. Number 9, the detonations of mines during the beginning of the Somme Offensive in France were so violent that sometimes the explosions could even be heard from London, England, more than 220 kilometers away. Number 10, many children enlisted to take part in the First World War. The youngest known British soldier was a boy named Sidney Lewis, who was only 12 years old, but there was one even younger who also fought in the conflict, the Serbian Mamsilo Gavrik who joined the country's armed forces at age 7 and was promoted to corporal when he turned 8. Number 11, although life in the trenches was not at all easy, the truth is that 9 out of 10 soldiers who were stationed in them survived the war. Number 12, did you know that the King of Belgium, Albert I, led his country's army personally during World War I? In fact, while the monarch was fighting, the Queen, Isabella of Bavaria, acted as a nurse and the Prince, Leopold III, participated as a private in the 12th Belgian Regiment. Number 13, it was only after the end of the First World War that Poland, Lithuania, Finland and Estonia emerged as independent nations. Number 14, after the declaration of war between the Austro-Hungarians and the Serbs, Germany declared war against Russia on August 1st, and two days later against France. Number 15, the conflict is the sixth with the highest death toll in history. Number 16, dogs were widely used as messenger, carrying orders to the battlefronts through capsules that were attached to their bodies. Number 17, about 40 kilometers of trenches were built on the famous Western Front alone, and many of them had names inspired by real addresses. Number 18, approximately 6,000 men died every day during the war. Number 19, every week approximately 12 million letters were delivered to soldiers. Number 20, the First World War started the development of plastic surgery, and the first blood banks were also created during the conflict. Number 21, so on the first day of the offensive at the Somme, after digging tunnels under the German trenches and positioning almost 30 tons of explosives, the British soldiers blew their enemies into the air. 
The crater resulting from the explosion exists to this day, measuring over 90 meters in diameter and over 20 meters deep. Number 22, the Spanish flu was responsible for the death of approximately one-third of all soldiers who lost their lives during the war. Number 23, officially, British soldiers had to be 19 years old to serve in the army. However, it is estimated that about 250,000 young men lied about their age and the youngest soldier on record was only 12 years old. Number 24, today, the flowers can be seen in spring and early summer around what was during the war the Western Front and serve to remember all the soldiers fallen during the battles. Number 25, the red poppy became the symbol of the First World War thanks to a surgeon from Canada named John McRae. The doctor wrote a sad poem in honor of a friend who died during the conflict, and in it he mentions the red poppies as blood from the fields of Flanders, Belgium. And we have reached the end of another video. Did you know about any of these? If you did, comment here below which one, I doubt it. And remembering to subscribe to the channel, until more curious.